to superior vena cava. Now, I don't care who your mink is, uh, everybody's got a superior vena cava. It's right there. See it? Comes out of the heart, whap. Superior vena cava, it actually goes to the heart. But. And, and here on the cat, there it is, superior vena cava. The mink has a longer neck, so it's gonna be a little different in appearance from the cat. You can move that out of the way. I well, I'd rather have you toward my side than my back. I never know what's going on if you're behind my back. Inferior vena cava, another easy one. All your minks are good for inferior vena cava, even this greasy one. Look at that thing there. Okay, inferior vena cava, big blue. The big blue. Got it? Everybody got that? That's too correct you're going to get on your paper. Nobody's going to miss that. Nobody's going to miss this. You right? You agree? Okay, okay good. Huh? Good. You're going to get it on your test. You don't want to be one of those kids that gets a 20. I know, that'd be awful. Well, it's embarrassing. I'd be ashamed to show my face in the school. Denominate, vein and artery. Okay, look, here's what you're going to see on the test. You're going to see this, the cat. We're going to have a pin right there. That's the anominate. Now, this one actually has an anominate too, right there and going the other way too. But you can see it much easier here. Innominate, okay? Uh, now artery, ooh, the innominate artery is a little different. Innominate artery, you can see it here as well. It's right there, the big pink one. Of course, big is relative. Innominate artery, right? Where is it on the cat that you're actually gonna have pins stuck in? Well, the pin will be stuck right there. See? Innominant artery. Savannah, do you see that? No. The answer is no. Get, get up closer. Make a place. Be forceful. No, you're short. You wouldn't be standing in front of someone else. You're shorter than those two boys. Yeah. Okay then pop in there. No, she can see over your shoulder. If you were a foot taller, that wouldn't be the case. All right, everybody get that? The innominant artery, there's only one. Innominant vein, there's two of them. There's one here and one here, right and left. Only one innominant artery, right? Oh, jeez. Is L.A. back there? L.A. Move up here somewhere so that I can sort of see you. Yeah. We're going to try to keep you from getting a 30 on the final. <laughs> okay, that sounds good. A 30, right. Okay. Carotid. No, jugular. Okay, jugular. All right, there's two of them. There's an external and an internal. Very well identified here. Uh, Yours kind of played out, but there it is right there. It's blue. It's lost its luster. But here's what you're going to see on the test. You're not going to see this on the test for these uh, appendageal veins. So external juggler, internal juggler. Now, Branham, what's this vessel right here? Right there, I'm kind of piddling with it. Is that the, um, the jugular one? Oh, which one? Internal. The internal jugular, okay. Now, look over on this side and you say, where's the internal jugular here? It didn't fill up. It's kind of mummified down there. But there's the external. So external, internal. All right, what's next? Will this be out for us to study on? What? Will this be out for us to study on? This will be out almost every day. Now that I've got the secret, just rub some mink grease on it and preserve it. <coughs> Look at that. 
It's like a new life formula or something. I could market that. Women would buy it because it would restore their face to their youthful appearance. They'd buy it. It's a lie, but they'd buy it. Carotid. Well, they're easy. Carotid, carotid. Uh, yeah, but what's this? Brandon, what's this? That one, I'm not sure. It's the carotid. Yeah. Carotid. Okay. Uh, yeah, you, you've, you've got them here too, but they're not really filled up. There it is right there. And the ones they tied off were the carotids. They've got the little threads on it. So that's the carotid, that pink thing there. Very tiny. Ah, uh, okay. Subclavian vein and artery. Easy. Okay. Subclavian. Now here's the anominant. Look at the first division there. There's the subclavian. Right there. Subclavian vein. Subclavian vein. I put a pin right there. Subclavian. Uh, what'd you do with that other cat? This one's not as old. I saved it because it's got excellent uh, arteries. Here, hold that. Oh, you got a little tattoo there. Oh, uh, yeah, that's my friend. And Christian. <laughs> <laughs> a little young, isn't she? <laughs> you see why I saved this? Somebody tell me why I saved this. You can see everything. I mean, it's got mold and crud on it. But look at those arteries. Holy cats the finest arterial formation ever seen. Uh, yeah, I hope you're, this, this, is, this is yours, isn't it? I hope it doesn't get all moldy now. It shouldn't. It looks like, it looks like small cats. Hmm? The, that one, they look like small cats. Not the, not the main. The, the cats, they look like... They're skinned. I know, but... Everything looks like a drowned rat when it's skinned. Why does it have styrofoam as well? It's old. It's, everything stinks when you're old. Or smells like yogurt. <laughs> I don't know. Let's, let me go over the arteries here with you while we're here. This is beautiful. This is a beautiful thing. Look at the aorta. Nice and round there. Wow, you've never seen a better aorta. Look at the anominate. Perfect. Look at the subclavian. This is the uh, left, no, right, yeah, left, left subclavian. It's always as it is on the animal. Left subclavian goes all the way to here. That's a big one, left subclavian. Now, the right subclavian isn't very far. I mean, it's, it's right there. It doesn't go very far. Inominate subclavian. Aorta, inominate subclavian. Inominate branches into three things. One, two, three. See that? One, two, three. One, two, three. Carotid, carotid, subclavian. Okay, now watch this journey here. The subclavian in the armpit, you can see, becomes the axillary right there. I put a pin right there. That's the axillary. It's red. We're looking at red now. And then, looky, behold, brachial and then if you can still see it or not you have radial and ulnar yeah, it looks like it gets kind of fine but you can see it going in there okay um, I will use this cat for arteries I can put one two three four five six seven at least seven pins there and then maybe the oh look at that holy smokes <coughs> beautiful i forgot how good this was look at that dorsal aorta magnificent look at that you go to the common iliac to the external iliac to the femoral before it fades out wow look at that renal Renal goes right into the kidney, renal artery. 
Yeah. Look for this animal on your test. We'll try to keep them uh, available to you uh, for your learning and edification pleasure. Now, where are we here? Uh, okay, I showed you the renal, adrenal, uh, radial and ulna. Yeah, we got to see the radial and ulna veins. All right, look, we're going back to here. Uh, the ulna goes to the elbow. Ulna to elbow. You can memorize that. Say that. Good, you got it. Ulna to elbow. That is the ulna. Now look, the radio goes the other direction. See, radio right there. So, pin-wise, watch this. Superior vena cava. Innominate. External, internal jugular. Subclavian. Axillary brachial, radial ulnar. Got it? What's the difference between the axillary and the... Um... Armpit axillary. Okay. All right. What's next? Vessels. Renal adrenal. We got them. Iliolumbar. Well, we're not doing the iliolumbar, obviously, but but it's it's right there. We're not doing that one because you can't see it in the mix. Uh, iliac, internal, external, we got that. There's the uh, common iliac, external iliac. Um, femoral, you know, blue, red, right in there, right in the femur. Uh, saphenous goes all the way down to the ankle. There's a saphenous vein. There's a saphenous vein. Either way, you got them. Can't miss it. Um, hepatic portal. That's an interesting one. Let me see if I can find it in, the, in a mink. Hepatic portal. You find the liver. You find the liver. And then you, you kind of flip it. And you look for a vessel that's coming uh, to the liver from the small intestine. It looks like it's right there. But you can usually see it better on these things. Whoa. Hmm. Well, not anymore. What was that? That's a liver. See that liver? It's got cirrhosis. And it really does. Check the difference in the sound. sounds harder. Good. Good. You're right. All right. What do we got? Uh, deep femoral. Okay. Deep femoral goes deep. See that thing right there going deep? It's going deep, isn't it? It's deep. Deep femoral. You got femoral, deep femoral. Okay. Uh, we did saphenous. Paddock poor you're not going to find. Uh, gastric, splenic, mesenteric. Uh, I doubt you're going to find them either. But the gastric is on the stomach. There's the gastric. It's on the stomach. Uh, the splenic is on the spleen. Maybe over here better. I don't know. Yeah, you can see the red thing on the spleen there. See it? Where's the spleen on the main? Well, the spleen on the... Uh, Think, you know, uh, right. It's kind of crinkled up on theirs, but there it is. There's a spleen. And if you, man, it's hopeless. Nothing filled up to tell, but that would be it. Didn't fill with any rubber, though. I used to be able to see it on this one. But it's just lost its flexibility. Now you can see the red along the spleen there. Splenic. Uh, pulmonary vein and artery, no problem. Uh, the mink is excellent for that, pulmonary vein and artery. Uh, you see that thing coming out of the heart? That's the pulmonary artery. Now you pull the lungs away. 
Do you see that vessel right there going into the heart? That's the pulmonary vein. Where's the pulmonary artery? Pulmonary artery is big. It's right there. Big, coming out of there. And then the ones are lower. The veins are lower, from, coming from the lungs. There's a good one right there. You can see it pretty clearly. It's dark. It's because it's got blood in it that dried. Hemizygous. Hemizygous is easy. Let's see if this animal has one. Yes. You see that blue thing right there going down? I could use this uh, mink for the hemizygous, no problem. I probably will. Yeah, that blue one there is the hemizygous. Okay, good. This is a pretty nice animal here. Uh, 